Well, I never expecting this to happen at the park. Maybe if I can see my friends Adrian, along with Midnight Maps and the Brandon mates in here. So, I think I should meet them. Alright. So, that the cost is clear. Now I am going to cut Gabrielle's hair. Ha 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 ha. But now, I now have scissors. So let's do it. Well, I already cut Gabrielle's hair and took one of it. Now I can use it to my friends including the cheer sweet girls. Oh hi Victoria, nice to meet you. So, what are you doing on- Ugh. Gabrielle, why are you shocked? Are you going to get me in trouble or something? Yes you're Victoria the Lemonhead Peterson. What are you doing here at the park? And why are you bring the scissors? Well, it's because I'm going to cut your hair for being friends with Adrian along with Brandon mates. That's why. What? Oh my god. You do not ever cut my hair like that. You know cutting my hair is forbidden. That's it. I will tell Carlos to come over here. Hey Carlos, can you come here for a second? There is something about that troublemaker Victoria. Ugh. What's going on here Gabriel? Is there something wrong with Victoria? Well, you're not going to believe what Victoria did. She just brought a scissors and cut my hair when I didn't do anything. What? Oh my god. Thanks for telling me Gabriel. Victoria is in so much trouble right now. I will deal with this myself. Victoria. I can't believe you bought a scissors and you cut Gabriel's hair. You know that cutting someone's hair is not very nice at all. That's it. Instead of your parents, I will call Molly Peterson. So, go home right now. Wow, Victoria. I just got the phone from Carlos Franks, and he said that you bring the scissors and cut Gabrielle's hair. You know that doing this was very unacceptable. And for this, you will be grounded for two and a half weeks. Go to your room right now and wait until my mom and dad gets home. <laughs>